Okay, so this is the first technique for the ghost trail effect for music videos. First, you need to make sure this button is pressed right here, so your clips don't move and you adjust them. Then scrub to the point where you want to cut and start the effect at. It all depends on your music and you know cutting it to the beat and all that. I'm gonna go right here, double tap the preview window, take a screenshot, and then you'll go back and go ahead and put a cut in that same place where you just took a screenshot. Then I'll go ahead and adjust the clip to the right, give it enough space for the screenshot to come in. Again, it's all going to depend on your beat and whatever looks good for your music. Then grab the screenshot, bring it in, adjust it to the right length, drop it in that space where you cut. Again, readjust it so it fits right. Go to edit, stretch the screenshot so it fits full to the screen. I like to check it out before I add anything to it. Then go to the middle of the two clips, add a transition, a cross dissolve transition. And that's what it looks like when you just put it on and don't do any adjusting. Then you can go and add a transition out of the still shot by going in between the two clips, adding a cross dissolve. So it's a little bit smoother. And you can also go and adjust the length of that first transition, or both of them. So that's kind of cool right there. There you go.